Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two Mr. Kipling flapjacks. I'm so excited because I didn't even know these existed. Carly sent us these from the United Kingdom. I have the golden syrup flapjack. And I have the cherry bakewell flapjack. I'm so excited about both of these. I love golden syrup and I love cherry bakewell. Uh, this is 114 calories per flapjack. And there should be two in here. Um, yeah, and you've heard how exact their calories are. 114. You wouldn't have gotten that oh, here. No, it's the whole thing. Oh, it's one big it's one. It's one big one. Yeah. Oh, it's one. I thought it would have had two in there. Yeah. Pretty good size flapjack, too. I mean, that's the size of a brownie. Mm. No, I said that wrong. Okay, I thought I had to have looked at that wrong. That's more than 114 yeah, calories. 100, 100. It is 272. I was looking at the wrong number. I apologize. 272 calories. It still is a very exact number. Um, they do not round them. It is a baked slice with oats and golden syrup with a chocolate flavored decoration. Yeah, it, this chocolate won't be flavorful, I don't think. It's good. The oats have a good flavor to it. They're good and soft. Mm-hmm. Good it's, amount of moisture. Mm-hmm. I like that. It's a very basic flapjack. Yeah. I was expecting it to be a little more golden well, syrup flavored, but right. It's a when when they do just the like the basic ones. That's what it is. It's a, it's a very very basic flapjack. It doesn't have any bells or whistles. Mm -hmm. um, this it's is, good though. Mm -hmm. I like it. But this is for people who don't want that extra flavor, like the cherry bake. Well, yeah. I'll get the calories right on this one. This one's 271 calories. The first one was more oaty than anything, not overly sweet, didn't have any other flavors besides the oat and a little bit of the golden syrup. Did you hold the other one up? Uh, yeah, just the, just the size, like how it fit. Uh, this one is, this is what I like about the cherry bakewell, an almond flavor, baked slice with oats, golden syrup, and glace cherries with a white decoration. So that's the good, that's what makes a bakewell a bakewell, is the almond and the cherry, or the, if it's a cherry bakewell. Yeah, and I don't see cherries actually in it, but... Mm. Definitely takes the almond. Love the almond. That one's good. I think it's a little drier than the first one, but. Now see, I thought the first one was drier. Mm. You mm. said the first one, you said it had a good amount of moisture. Yeah, and you thought it was true. I, I thought it a little bit. I thought it was a touch dry, the first one. No, the first one's moisture. Well, I definitely like the cherry bakewell the best. And I would pick the other one. Would you really? Yeah, I'm just so careful that cherry flavor. I mean, it's not that I don't care for it. I don't, it's not that I don't like it. I like it. It's not something I would prefer. That's why Tammy doesn't get a bakewell tart made for her very often. It's because Tammy's the only one that eats it. And it takes a long time. But it's worth it. They're so good. Oh, they're so good. But literally, I'm the only one that eats it. So did that capture the cherry bakewell tart flavor for you? It did. I thought it was very good. I it's think, good. Um, I think, but given, if I was given a choice between buying the, the tarts, the Mr. Kipling Bakewell tarts or this, I would buy the tarts because I like this, but I just, I like that, uh, the crust on the tarts and I don't know, it has the cherry in the middle. It has, um, the icing. It has that layer of white, uh, icing on the top and um, it's a little bit moister on the inside. No, it's more, it, well, it's a tart. It's so a tart. It, it's got a filling in it. Right. It's not, so it's I not would, icing, but it's a filling. Right, so I would rather have, uh, I would rather have the tart. But yeah. it definitely captured the flavor. It's definitely that cherry. Well, it does have smoke. icing. It has the, it? yeah, it has a white, it has a white frosting, no, just like, just like our bagel tart when we made it. We put the white frosting on no. the top. 
Yeah. And I don't then we put the, it's been a while since I had one. Then we put the pink squiggles on the top. Yeah. 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 It has okay. white. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I so, yeah. So, the Mr. Kipling tart, it has like a the cherry in the middle, and then it has the white icing, and yeah. then they put the cherry right in the middle yeah. of it. Yeah. Uh, okay. But overall, I like this, but I like the tart better. Right. Yeah. So, but out of the two, we would both choose different ones. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> You know, but they're both really good though. They are good. So Carly, thank you very much for sending them to us. We appreciate it. I hope everyone else enjoyed it and thanks for watching.